The youth in the Valley will get an opportunity to get assistance to both further their education and career goals. Luciana Morales is here to tell us all about it. Thank you for joining us, of course. Thank you, Michelle. It's a wonderful day outside, but even wonderful news that you have for us today. Correct. So Workforce Solutions Cameron is hosting its first uh, open house for foster youth and former foster youth. It will take place on Thursday, February the 8th. Um, and it will be um, open to, to, to the public. What we would like to do is invite former foster youth and foster youth to join us to find out about internships, scholarships, and different opportunities about um, finding a job and also creating resume, everything that our organization, the Workforce Solutions Cameron, can do for them. Wonderful, but we do have some great tips that can apply to all youth in the Valley, and let's start with this one. Know your rights, what do you, know, what do you mean by that? Yes, so especially for former foster youth and foster youth, what we would like to, to advise is that they advocate, that they are aware of what are their rights and opportunities. So we would like to advise uh, for them to talk to their social workers so they can be aware of the different uh, opportunities and scholarships. And in addition to that, whenever they are about to embark on a new uh, journey, including college or any post-secondary education, or even when they, are, um, when they want to, um, to know about their options, we encourage them to reach out. There are many organizations out there, many nonprofit organizations, many programs, and many of them are, um, uh, have them, the foster youth, as one of their priority populations, which means that they will, they will be more than happy to, to assist them in, in, in their efforts. And lastly, we would like, of course, to, to advise for them to come to a workforce center because this, in, in our um, centers, we can help them with all of their job finding efforts. Certainly, I want to ask you why uh, foster youth is such a goal or a priority right now for you guys. It's, it's been a priority of us for a while, but um, our organization likes to um, empower the youth because uh, we realize that the future workforce needs to be aware of their opportunities, whether it's about career exploration or also about knowing not about the different work and employment related opportunities. The youth is, is crucial to the sustainment of our prosperity as a community, as a region. Luciana, thank you so much. But thank before we go, me. we want to make sure that you get that information about when the event will be taking place. So we do have a graphic to show you. Hopefully we can pull it up. Again, that's happening on Thursday, February 8th. And that is uh, happening at the address 601 East Harrison in Harlingen. Luciana, thank uh -huh. you. We'll be right back. We're tracking developing news. Stay with us.